let me show you the ingredients <clears throat> here I have a two pound of chicken I have a chicken with the bones and it's it's two pound it's a whole chicken I should say and then I have a uh, one and a half cup of yogurt it's a plain yogurt nothing is added in it I have onion I have um, what do you call green chili I call or you can call uh, jalapeno I have tomatoes you can see I cut the tomatoes in a chunk because I'm gonna grind everything in this and then I have a uh, spices uh, it's red chili it's um, salt it's turmeric it's coriander powder and it's called garam masala it's all spices mix and and then I have a uh, cumin seeds and that's the only spices I use and trust me if you don't have any of them if you only have turmeric salt and paprika and black and black pepper you you good that's all you need so what are we gonna do now I'm gonna put all these spices in here and the yogurt and we're gonna mix it and we marinate for half an hour more is good but I don't have too much time so I'm just gonna marinate for half an hour and or until my rice is done and then we then i'll show you what am i gonna do so right now i'm gonna put all these spices in here and marinate with the yogurt and put it in the fridge for half an hour and i'll see you in half an hour so see chicken is <coughs> i uh, with the yogurt i mix it everything and it's ready to be marinated for half an hour that's how it looks like and that's all you need you don't need a whole lot of things to make a chicken curry and so now we're gonna go forward and then all these things I'm gonna put it in a gr in a blender grinder whatever you call and here is my candle and you know can you believe it even I have a candle on but still my neighbors can smell my food my cooking so I that's all the candle it's very important and now let's okay. go I have to a the oil next in step. there a little bit and I'm gonna add a little more oil in there and as you can see I cook in olive oil I don't have I usually cook in avocado oil but I don't have uh, avocado oil and it wasn't available in the market so here's a cumin seed I'm gonna put those in there and just and a little bit of onion. I'm not going to put too much onion in there. Just a little bit. And let's cook a little bit. Onion has to get a little translucent, not too, uh, too brown. We don't need the too brown onions in there. And as I told you, I'm going to grind everything. So tomatoes, jalapeno, and it's all uh, I grounded all this in here and since the onion is pretty much the way I like it it's not too it's not too brown just translucent I'm gonna add um, garlic and ginger paste in there and that make a little noise so I'm gonna hold the camera for a second so since a uh, garlic and ginger paste and uh, onion got uh, cooked a little bit now we're gonna add our paste and at this uh, usually about the the top look that's how it's supposed to be the more you cook the more you better now we're going to add the chicken which is marinated more than half an hour you can marinate overnight too the more you marinate the more is good 
So we're going to put all this yogurt and spices in there as much we can. I don't like wasting anything. See, it's already looked so, so good and tasty and mouth-watering, huh? Now we're going to add a little bit of water. Just a little, not whole a lot, because the uh, yogurt also is, when it cooks, it's going to become a little watery. So we're just going to add a little bit of water and let it cook for 10-15 minutes, the chicken get all cooked and done. See, it's already looking so good. So remember I said I'm going to use the uh, whatever was in there. So no wasting again. You can see the gravy is thick and it looks good. Curry, you can call chicken curry, you can call chicken korma. But when we say chicken korma, then we add any kind of nuts like almonds or um, cashews. But this we can call chicken yogurt chicken or chicken curry with yogurt, right? There we go. See how beautiful they look. That's how it's supposed to be. So now we're gonna let it cook till the chicken is done. And I'm gonna clean this. And here's the rice is all ready. And I'm gonna put it in here to send it over to their house. Look like it's getting done. I can see the oil is coming at the top. Look, that's how it's supposed to be. But so I'll wait a few more minutes till we get, get it done. Okay, see, it's all ready. I'm gonna dish out and send it over to their house and show you too. Our 